Hello students, today we continue the development of embryo. Last class we discussed the development of dicot embryo as well as structure of dicot embryo. Now we discuss about uh, development of monocot embryo. Development of embryo we call as embryogeny. Embryogeny in monocot. In this one, already male gamete fuses with the female, then it forms zygote and all. Otherwise, we call it as oospore. In this one, this is oospore. What is the ploid of oospore? Where it located? Already, last class we told related to zygote, it is present towards the micropylar region and all. In towards micropylar region, the whose pore is present. In this whose pore, it divides transversely. Then it forms two cells. Transverse division, it forms two cells. One is the basal cell, another one is the Terminal cell under. Towards micropyle laser, towards micropyle laser, that is a basal cell. Towards chalaza or antipodal reason, that is the terminal cell under. Next, in basal cell, further does not divides only terminal cell only it undergoes divisions takes place in the then in terminal cell it divides one more transverse wall then it forms into the total three cells are formed and one is this is the basal cell then the terminal it divides Two cells. This is the base cell. This is the middle cell and the terminal or apical cell. So listen carefully. Only terminal cell only undergoes division, whereas basal cell only the size of the cell enlarges. It does not undergo any division center. That's why it will be formed three cell stage. What are the names which are present in three cell stage? One is the in that basal cell. It acts as vascular suspension cell. The basal cell it undergoes vascular. Suspensor cell. That's why three cell stage and all. Then remaining the terminal, the terminal cell, it differentiate after multiple divisions. The terminal cell, it further it divides and it forms. That is a plumule as well as a single cotyledon. Here in monocot. Cotyledon represent scutel lobe. So terminal cell it undergoes further it forms cotyledon as well as scutel lobe. Middle cell further multiple mitotic divisions then it undergoes and it develops and it produces to form hypophysis as well as radical. That is two parts are formed and all. Once again. Terminal cell, plumule, cotyledon, that means scutel lobe. Middle cell, hypophysis as well as radical. Whereas basal cell, it enlarges in its size. It does not undergo any division. That is only major difference between no, dicot embryo as well as monocot embryo. Then it acts as a 
the major function that is the pastoria the vascular suspensor cell only single it is present it act as that the particular pastorium the function it has as pastorium and all then due to multiple division center it forms it is little bit enlarged in size then it undergoes division this is pastorium pastorium then due to multiple after that one it forms is a larger pastorium due to this word here it represent this particular part that is a cotyledon in this part plumule so both are alternately divides both middle as well as the terminal cell alternatively it ready to undergo ready to divisible and all the next one the next stage it will be forms a complete development which takes place both middle as well as terminal cell and all middle and terminal cell and all like this is prominent one here in this part it represents a radical this is the cotyledon or otherwise called as cotyledon this is uh, plumule this is uh, suspensor cell it act as pastorium so one among these while undergoes this middle cell some of this cell it must be act as suspensor cell also apart from this one basal cell single only that has vascular suspensor cell and all then radical below that one hypophysis like this it will be present and all then if it is uh, the next two stage if we observe due to single cotyledon or otherwise we call it as cotyledon it pushes that particular plumule laterally that's why it lies in depression laterally plumule lies in depression normally monocot embryo that plumule present lateral side then next stage if you observe on particular side this is suspensor suspensor cell this is the radical this is the cotyledon this is the plumule that particular after this particular stage it is present and due to presence of single cotyledon it pushes that particular lateral side towards light towards the depression and all then this is the common related to different steps and all so in a dicot if we observe there it will be present a specific heart shape then it will be also present in torpedo and all then matured embryo and all here 
only up to spherical it is present. After spherical, it is elongated, normally it is present and all. Then after matured, up to here it is, this is the matured monocot embryo. Matured monocot embryo it is a common. Some of the grasses, the matured monocot embryo, it is present. Some of the grasses, the matured monocot embryo, it is present. So how it is present, observe carefully. is uh, the laterally related to the cotyledon cotyledon it is present the cotyledon some of these uh, specific to the particular type of the grasses in the grasses this particular type of this embryo, the structure of the monocot embryo, Why? because scutellum, that means the cotyledon, it is specifically visible at all. In this one, the lower related to the upper part, the upper due to scutellum, it will be pressures, it will be forces so it will be forces and uh, presses presses towards this direction then a specific here it will be present that is the uh, shoot apex is present at the uh, shoot apex then the lower side it is uh, present There is a root cap here, here it will be present, a small epiblast it will be present and all. If you observe here, this is the shoe apex, this is the scutellum, that is regarded as cotyledon, this is the radical, this is the root cap, root cap. This is epiblast. So observe carefully epiblast. Epiblast is a rudimentary secondary cotyledon and all. Normal in monocots, only single cotyledon is present and all. But here a specific epiblast is present. It is a rudimentary, rudimentary secondary cotyledon. It represents rudimentary secondary cotyledon. But in monocot embryo, in the tissue, that means the plumule region, it covers with the help of scutellum, it covers the additional membrane that is we call as polyoptile. Here, this is we call as polyoptile. That is most important. Polyoptile is the membrane it covers towards the shoe apex and down. Similarly, this is uh, Colio Riza. Colio Riza is, is the membrane it cover over the radical. So that is important. Colio type it covers towards the shoot apex, whereas Colio Riza it covers over the radical and all. This Colio type, Colio Riza normally present, normally arises from scutellum. These are special characteristic features of monocot and all. Whereas epicotyl related to plumule, hypocotyl related to radical, that is a common, both it is present and all. But polyorhiza, polyoptyl, it is a specific characteristic features of the, that the specific monocot embryo. So based on this diagrammatically, you observe very carefully here in gigot which are present in micropylar region that it undergoes a transverse division then one base cell one terminal then once again it divides only terminal cell only divides base cell cell does not undergo any division it uh, continues as a larger that only single suspensor cell it acts as hostorium function 
then only terminal cell only it undergoes and the formation of complete uh, embryo and all. So, like this, up to spherical, it is similar both, but except this uh, three cell stage, it is present only here, only this particular monocot embryo, whereas the dicot it is not uh, Then, it will be present like this uh, particular area and all. What is the functioning of epiblast? Epiblast, it is, it is nothing but rudimentary part of uh, secondary cotyledon. Uh, Another example point of view, which one represent the specific cotyledon that is scutella, it represent as this one the specific, the particular type of the cotyledon and all. Then based on this one, in example point of view, what type of questions they ask and the, they ask related to the plumule, where it located plumule, in monocot plumule located lateral region. Whereas they got plumule room located in apical region, terminal region and all. The heart shape of embryo generally we observe. Where we observe heart shape of embryo, heart shape of embryo generally we observe in. They give many different options. You must choose heart shape during development of embryo. That is none other than dicot. Then, what is the difference between uh, Related to epicotai as well as hypocotai. What is the difference between epicotai as well as hypocotai? Related to epicotai, epicotai it covers to the plumule. That is, we represent. What is the difference between no? epicotai as well as hypocotai? Epicotai is the part which is present uh, between plumule, that means uh, between plumule as well as uh, the node of cotyledon. It locates between the node of cartilidon and plumule. That means simple between cartilidon as well as plumule. Whatever the whatever the portion, whatever the area which located between cartilidon as well as plumule that represent epicotai. What is it by hypocotai? Very simple, between cotyledon as well as radical. Very simple, remember, between no, cotyledon as well as a radical. In future, that means the further development, what it undergoes radical, radical undergoes root, what it undergoes plumule, plumule undergoes to the shoe. Then, but epicotyl, it is normally, it represents, that means uh, where it will be present between the rat, that means cotyledon as well as plumule, epicotyl is present, hypocotyl between cotyledon as well as radical, radical will be present and all. That is major and all. Then, what about monocot as well as dicot embryo? Monocot embryo as well as dicot embryo. Dicot embryo monocot embryo. So, if you observe this one, then you undergo at least one or two bits ready to ask and all in object to type of and all. In dicot embryo, what is the difference? Normally, base cell cell provides, base cell cell forms 6 to 10 cells of suspensory cells and all. Here, Basal cells forms 6 to 10 cells of suspensory suspensory cells and all. Whereas monocot embryo, basal cell forms only one suspensory cell. So basal cell forms only one 
suspensory. It is only enlarged while growth and development of another cell cell wall. Then another very important one, the terminal cell provides terminal cell produce complete embryo. Here terminal cell produce that a complete embryo that accept radical that is important from where radicality undergoes radical it produces one among the cells of suspensory already said in the epical part towards the micropylar region it acts as pastorium that which are the present uh, towards the radical side that is root cap that is nothing but radical and all in that part that means basal part develops a radical in a dicot and all whereas in monocot the terminal cell itself it undergoes it produces it develops a complete embryo here terminal cell itself produce complete embryo including radical including radical why because here base cell cell does not undergo further division and all here base cell cell it undergoes uh, minimum 2 to 3 mitotic division that's why 6 to 10 suspensory cell frag that means uh, elongated frag elongated suspensory cell it will be formed and all then here in dicot embryo the terminal plumule is present here the terminal plumule is located here lateral side that the plumule located it is a lateral this is important lateral side this is important terminal side in the dicot very simple two cotyledons are present in dicot here it is present two cotyledons here single cotyledon single cotyledon is present here two cotyledons are present and all so that is related to monocot as well as dicot based on this embryo it is very important what is done by embryonal axis what is done by polyoctyl what is done by polio riser what is done by epicotyl what is done by hypocotyl what it undergoes in further radical what it undergoes plumule in further so what is the another name of cotyledon in monocot embryo that means scutellum what type of embryo normally present the lateral it lies in lateral depression that is either monocot or dicot instead of this one they give any one among the examples of monocot as well as dicot plants and all then what is it by poly embryony what is it by poly embryony name itself represent one more subtopic in the same chapter they are given in detail here already embryo is embryo already just now we discussed and now we are discussing that's why Simple, what is done by poly embryony? Further detail we discuss in you know, further class. Under. Now we discuss what is done by poly embryony? More than one or two, that means more than one embryo in a seed. So, development of embryo more than one in a seed. Development of development of more than one embryo in a seed and all. So, development of more than one embryo, one embryo in a seed. That is important. In one seed, multiple embryos are present. How means? Because of entering. Entering of many type of the pollen tubes and all. Normally one. If it is entering multiple, then there may be possibility and all. Who is the scientist expert about polyembryony? Levenu, which plant? Citrus plants and all. 
that is uh, live and hope the discovered poly embryoni in in citrus plants and all in this one how many types and uh, according to formation of embryo there are two types one is the simple another one is the adventive and all either simple or uh, adventive simple embryoni as well as adventive embryoni what is the way simple embryoni simple embryoni means multiple number of embryo sacs if it is present such type of uh, formation of multiple embryos that is we call as simple embryoni then if it is present to multiple number of embryo sacs normally only one functional megaspore it undergoes it forms into the only one embryo sac and if it is all four if it is a megaspore mother cell if it is undergoes four functional megaspores then four embryo sacs are formed actually one functional megaspore suppose if it is all are functional four embryo sac four embryo sac means four pollen tube each and every egg cell it, it will be fusion it will be fertilized it forms into the four embryos that's why multiple number of embryo sacs it fertilizes with the multiple number of male gametes then through the egg cell that is we call a simple embryo the example brassica example in brassica then what is it by adventive embryo the without multiple embryo sacs that means uh, within one embryo sac the embryos are develops from uh, new cells the embryos are develops from integuments here the multiple embryos are developed from new cells as well as and integuments such type of such type of formation of embryo is called as adventive embryo ni example citrus as well as mangifera mangifera indica that is related to the adventive embryo ni and all so normally in this uh, specific type of embryo that means whether it is simple whether it is uh, Advent to all many different types. When our fusion, when our fusion, when our formation, the multiple number of the embryo sac or other than that particular cell. Here, even at the time of growth and development, the embryo growth and development, which one provides food material for complete growth and development of embryo and the endosperm and all. After maturation, it disappears. Some of the seeds, some seeds, it must be persisted and all. Okay. that is so what we discussed so this particular class we discussed about the development of monocot embryo the difference between monocot as well as dicot embryo then what is meant by poly embryo ni which type of the plants normally it undergoes normally we observe into the poly embryo ni here we observe very carefully whereas in monocot instead of cotyledon we represent scutellum and all then another very important plumule location of the plumule whereas in monocot plumule it will be present lateral side whereas in dicot plumule it present apical part terminal part so some of the grasses were coleo rhiza which covers on the plumule side and all that means the shoot apex and all whereas the radical the covering part that is we called as none other than coleo rhiza and all so that is remember very carefully and all So remaining discussion next to class